In this video I'm going to show you how to make arepas with all my favorite fillings like refried beans, avocado, dairy-free cheese and more. I made delicious arepas. These are vegan, naturally gluten-free, easy to make and so delicious. So we start the recipe by adding warm water to a large bowl. Then we add a little salt and next we add the pre-cooked corn flour gradually. Pre-cooked corn flour is also known as mazarepa. Make sure to stir between each addition. Arepas are a popular South American food originating in Colombia and Venezuela made of an unleavened ground maize dough. They can be grilled, baked or fried until crisp outside and tender in the middle. These tasty caramel cakes require just three ingredients for the dough, one bowl and about 30 minutes of your time. When it's cool enough to handle, use your hands to gently knead it for a minute, then allow the dough to rest for 10 minutes. When ready, it should be moist but not sticky. Next, divide the arepa dough into six portions and roll each into a ball. If the dough is too dry, like cracking a lot when shaping, add a little more water. And if it's too wet, just add a little more flour. I did weigh them and they were about 110 grams per ball. After rolling them into balls, flatten each ball into a disc. And if any small cracks appear, use wet fingers to gently pat them until smooth. Now we heat a large non-stick pan or well-seasoned cast iron skillet over medium heat and add a swirl of oil. Working with three arepas at a time, cook them for about 5 minutes per side until they are golden brown on both sides. If you want the arepas to be very crispy, then bake them in the oven for about 10 minutes. Not only is this arepas recipe quick and easy, but it requires minimal ingredients and a low fast process even children can get involved with. And then finally repeat this process with the remaining three arepas. Allow them to cool for just a few minutes before cutting each arepa about three-fourths of the way around to create a pocket and stuff them with all your favorite fillings. So for the filling I made vegan scrambled eggs and the recipe for this is on my blog ellavegan.com I also made vegan tofu meat, meat. I made uh, refried beans and the recipe for the refried beans is also on my blog and then here we have vegan mozzarella and the recipe is also on my blog and in my cookbook simple and delicious vegan and then here are also veggies like cucumbers and tomatoes and red As mentioned before, I made my own dairy-free mozzarella at home and I will link the recipe in the video description below. I also made tofu meat with just a few simple ingredients. Next we have refried beans and you will see the recipe also linked in the video description below. And finally vegan scrambled eggs also linked below. Southern American cuisine absolutely spoils us with the options for quick, simple and delicious handheld treats. Between empanadas, pupusas, tacos and arepas, to just name a few, there isn't a week that goes by without at least one featuring on my weekly menu. These arepas are just so delicious and I really hope you will give them a try.
Here you can see me tasting them. I could seriously eat them every day. They are so yummy. And don't worry, our cat Amarillo didn't eat any of them. And if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more vegan and gluten-free recipes. I hope to see you in my next video. Bye! And then... Oops. Amarillo! Oh.